Hey dolls! So today I am unboxing another mystery box, but before I get into that, I just want to say thank you to all of my new subscribers who have come to my channel because of my mystery box unboxings. Welcome! Have a look around, watch some of my old embarrassing videos, and get excited for new content. Yeah, just thank you for support and for watching my videos. Also, before I get into it, my shirt is from Hot Topic, in case any of you guys were curious. And yeah, with that being said, now let's get on into this video and the reason you guys are here. This is a $50 mystery box, except I kind of cheated the system a little bit. I still, it is still a mystery to me. I still don't know what's in here. I have no idea. But what I did was I gave $50 to a friend through PayPal and I asked her to go on a website that accepted PayPal and that would ship everything in one box to me and she got to pick out whatever she wanted for me. And so I know that I'm not going to be getting scammed because it's not through someone that I have no idea who they are. It's basically like giving my money to someone to spend for me without me knowing what it is. So it's kind of like my boyfriend buys my outfits, my girlfriend buys my outfits, those kind of videos. like they're using your money to buy something for you. So that's kind of what I did. I sent 50 bucks to my friend and she went on the Claire's website. That is the website we kind of just decided on because that you can get quite a bit of stuff from Claire's for 50 bucks. It all shipped in this little package and they accepted PayPal on their website. So if you guys end up liking this video, I will leave a poll on the screen right here. If you click the little eye icon on the top right hand side of the screen, the little poll will drop down. And if you guys want me to do another one, one of these please vote there because I will use that tally and that vote because next time when I do this it'll be a hundred dollars so if this is good enough and you guys like the outcome of this vote on that poll so I know to do another one and go one step bigger so let's see what fifty dollars bought me <laughs> Okay, my friend and I do share like very very well same tastes. Uh, it is my friend Angel. Her uh, YouTube channel is Dollhouse Unboxing. I will link her channel on the screen. So if you like my content and you like kind of my girly aesthetic, you can definitely go check hers out. There is an invoice in here. We're not even gonna look at that. I don't even know. All I did was open the box. I haven't actually seen anything yet. So here we go. There's some bubble wrap. That's awesome. Let's get into the goodies here. Oh, I see some shades. Okay, I see these first, so I'll just grab these out. These are some heart sunglasses, and they're pink and glittery. I have so many sunglasses, you guys. Hold on, before I put them on, I'll show you what they look like. They're all glittery, and that's what they look like on. They actually look really cute on. That's pretty cool. These were $12.99, it says on the tag. Now keep in mind, she could have got some of this on sale. I have no idea. So $12.99, good job. Good job, we're off to a good start. <laughs> Next, we have, oh yes, yes. Okay, this says $9.99, and it is a Pusheen Pom Pom keychain. Just looks like that. So stinking cute. I'm gonna put this on one of my new purses. Very cute. I love that. Okay, so $9.99 for that. Good job, Angel. Good job, good job. Okay, then, oh my gosh, okay. My battery is dying, so I'm gonna change my battery real quick before I look at anything else. Good job, Angel. Good job, good job. Okay, then, oh my gosh, okay. My battery is dying, so I'm gonna change my battery real quick before I look at anything else. Okay, I just switched out my battery. Hopefully that one is charged enough to last us a little while. In here is a mystery... Pusheen surprise plush keychain and this says $9.99 as well but this is a Christmas themed one and here are the little cuties that you can get oh my gosh what if I get the angel one and it was angel who picked it out okay I don't know which one I want I'm just gonna open it and find out because usually I never get the one that I truly want anyway so let's just see this is a real true mystery unboxing because there's a mystery box inside of a mystery box Mystery Boxception. Oh, cute. Oh, it's pushing with a Santa hat holding a little bell. How cute. Oh, these are ornaments. I thought they were keychains, but they're little ornaments for your Christmas tree. That is so cute. 
Aww, I'm gonna put that on my Christmas tree. <laughs> Let's see, what is this? This is, oh, I love this. Okay, this was $5.99. And it is a ring for the back of your phone. Kind of like, you know how they have those pop sockets. This is a phone ring. And it is a bow. It's a blinged out bow that is totally my style. I love this. This is so cute. And then you can have the ring. Um, oh, this one's super hard to turn. I'm going to have to like work with this one and manipulate it around to make it a little bit easier. But... That is perfect. I'll put that on the back of my Mophie case. Next, we have Claire's. Oh my gosh, this smells good. This is why, okay, she did ask me one question. She asked me if I preferred lemon or blueberry, I think it was, and or chocolate. And I told her that I preferred fruit scents over chocolate scents or something like that. So this is the only thing that I kind of had an idea of what it was because she asked me what scents I liked. This is a lemon scented bath balm in the shape of a star and it's on a little stick so you can kind of swirl it around and feel like you're a fairy godmother swirling your bath water and making it beautiful colors. It did come a little bit broken right here but you know, I'm not gonna complain too much cause it's just a little tiny bit. Next we have some hand sanitizers. Oh, these are precious. These were each $7, $6.99 each. And we have a little penguin. I think the scents that are in these are just um, regular, but there's a penguin one. Oh, it's plugged. It has a cap on it. I was like, why can I not smell anything? It smells like regular hand sanitizer. I think I could be wrong. There could be like a certain scent to it, but they don't say. And then this one right here is a little purple one with a polar bear that has Christmas lights wrapped around it. Very cute. So there are both of those little guys. And then we have, ooh, we have another one of those phone rings except this one is a little panda bear. I don't know if you can really tell, but it's a little panda bear with the ring part as his little nose. Very cute. And again, you can kind of just manipulate the ring around. It just looks like that. And then this part just peels off and you stick it on your phone case or just on directly on the back of your phone. And then you can stick your finger through the little ring so that you can take selfies or hold up your phone and you're less likely to drop it and it to shatter. And this one was $5.99. Okay, and there's one last thing in here, and it is a mug. <laughs> and one thing that Angel and I have in common is that we love mugs, we love tea sets, we love to drink tea, and so this may or may not be very, very, very good. <laughs> I'm assuming it will be. Oh, it's a pushing mug. I can't see anything yet. I can't see anything yet. Oh, there's something inside of it, too. Oh, I think that's a bath bomb. I'll look at that in a second. I'm too excited. Let's, you know what? Should we save the mug? Oh, no, let's look at it now. Let's just look at it now. Okay, it's pushing. Oh, it says perfect weekend. This has no price. $9.99. Ooh, 10 bucks for a mug. That's a really good deal. Very cute. Oh my gosh. This is so precious. Look at this, you guys. Aww. I always use my Marie mug that I got when I went to Disneyland for my tea, but I might have to use this one once in a while. This one might actually be bigger. I'm not sure, but it's just so like, oh, I love mugs and I love tea and I might have to make myself some tea or hot cocoa after this video with this mug. Look how big it is. It's almost as big as my face. Like, I love it. And then this last thing right here is a bath bomb. I think that's the very last thing. Yes, it is. This little bath bomb was $6.99, and it doesn't have a labeled fragrance on it. It just says bath fizzer, but it smells really good. And it is this, like this pastel purple, pink, and blue colors. It's kind of like really super pastel tie-dye. Do you guys see that? It's like kind of marbled in there. It's really cute. So... Definitely, once my bathtub is working again, I will be able to use these bath bombs. Everything was really good. Let me know if you guys liked this, as I said before. And also, vote in the poll right there if I should do another one of these 
through a different website and just send money to a friend and have them pick out things for me. Uh, the next one that I will be doing will be worth a hundred dollars. So was the $50 one good? Do you think we did well enough? Should I do a hundred dollar one and have a different friend pick items out for me or the same friend or you know just should I do another one of these? Just let me know in that little poll right there and uh, maybe we can do it. The mug and the and the keychain, the pom-pom are definitely my two favorite things. So thank you so much Angel for picking out these little goodies for me. It was kind of like a one person swap. It's kind of weird. It's like someone else spending your money without you knowing what you're getting. It's kind of invigorating and fun and just the anticipation of it being a mystery is really cool and you know that you're not going to get screwed over. So if you yourself have been wanting to get a mystery box but you're concerned that maybe you're just going to be throwing your money away, try this technique instead or try this version of it and just give your friends some money, tell them to go to the store, pick some stuff out for you, put it in a box, wrap it up, and then you can unbox it and it's kind of the same concept except you know you're not going to be getting totally scammed and sent a literal box of trash. So again, thank you guys for watching. If this is the first video you guys are watching of mine, please feel free to hit the subscribe button down below and maybe possibly hit that bell icon so you know when my future content gets uploaded. Thank you guys again and I will talk to you all next time. So until then, so long, stay strong, stay true, and be you. All right, bye!